So... Unknown intruder detected inside facility. Threat level yellow. Deploying guards inside the facility. Oh, you only said it was threat level yellow because I'm Asian. Warning, warning. Attention intruders. Leave the facility immediately. I repeat, leave the facility immediately. Huh? Intruders? That means us, right? Connecting to the network. Even though that still hasn't helped me at all. Um, I got this fucking bat with me. Uh, I don't need to change anyone's tactics, right? No. Actually, I just want to see how many, how many, um, how many fucking keys I have. Where do I find the keys? Did I pass it? Oh, here it is, chess key. I have four. Okay, cool. I mean, <laughs> I'm sitting here running past the chest already. Watch it be a shadow. Purifying salt. I'll take it. All right, Chie. You and Yosuke have been plotting on my downfall this whole entire fucking playthrough. Watch it. That Damn it. Um... Well, I mean, I guess I'm gonna be using wind. For the most part. Three enemies. Let me do it. Get rid of it, Chie. Okay, okay. Good job, girl. Damn it, you guys are strong as hell. Kanji, that was great. You're the man. Oh, come on, Chie. Every fucking time. <laughs> so persistent. See, Chie, this is what happens. Come on, this fight's not over. This is what happens when you fuck up, Chie. All right. You almost got us killed. Persona luck up. Gimbu, well... Yeah, I mean... Why not? Start replacing some Personas. Which ones don't we need? We don't need... Uh, we don't need Magician anymore, like, obviously. The stuff for the social links we don't need anymore. I leveled up. Have I gotten a little stronger? Ha! More power for me! All right. Um, actually, let me just go over what I don't need. I'll keep strength with me. Mainly for, like, uh, golden shadows running around. Hangman, I'll keep you. Emperor, I'll keep. Chariot, really don't need. Uh, what's the button to get rid of your ass? No. Hi, Pixie. Eh, I'll keep you around, I guess. I still need you for Dojima. Queen Mob, I need you. I do not need you anymore. Angel, I'll still keep you around. Nanako's not completely finished, so... Oh, shit. Damn it! Don't let it get away. Of course, Marukanda, of course. Senpai, your defense has been lowered. Arvati. Tell me something I don't know. Two enemies Keep it down. Keep going, Senpai. Damn it, Chie, you're supposed to get the follow-up on that. You're supposed to kick that man to the heavens. That's the way, Senpai. Do some more damage. Uh, what is it? Torrent shot? I think I might have some items to help out with this. Um, let me see. Frost, fire, cast Hamon, collect, wind damage, wind damage, ice damage, ice damage, fire damage. Nope. No item to help me with this. All right. Well, GA. Uh. Assault dive. I mean, yeah, assault dive. I'd rather not have you miss and f 
fall on your ass and have it run away. Oh my fucking god, never mind. Never mind. Never mind, Chie. Never mind. Never mind. You're fucking worthless. You're worthless to me. There. I couldn't do it. <sighs> what health do these guys have? Well, they're down. I mean, they're gonna get up next turn. Probably fuck me up. So right now, just Rakunda. God damn it. Chia, you're just useless to me. You know that? Eh. I could have done fire break, but... I already wasted enough time. Ow! Oh, well, that's not good. I was really hoping Chie would, you know, do my follow-up, but you know what? Fuck it. Yeah, ain't worth it. Definitely not worth it right now. Get us out of here. Just hang on. I'll find you an opening. Is Media my strongest one? Oh shit. What items do I got? 400? That's a little much, but okay. Now's your chance. Run! That was terrible. And we can all blame it on Chie. Thanks a lot for fucking nothing. Immune to fire. Which one's immune to fire? You can't just say that and expect me to instantly know. Here goes. Push it up. Lay down and die already. Three enemies left. You can win this. I'll finish you. There we go. You ain't holding back. Do it again, Chie Senpai. Where the fuck? Oh, I was looking for Augie. We are gonna have a difficult time in here, aren't we? Persona level up? Or a new persona? New persona. I can fuse you later. This is why I always grind beforehand, so we wouldn't run into problems like this. Shadow box! Oh, salt signal. Thank you. How we hold it up, team? No one's dead yet? Thanks for the heads up. All right, well, win sucks. Oh, Senpai needs help. That's amazing, Yukiko Senpai. Keep it up. All right. Shouldn't someone heal Yukiko Senpai? She can heal herself. It ain't going down. All right, well, someone's. Immune to ice. I just don't know which one. That one's totally weak. Four enemies. That one's totally weak. You know, Better not lose. when you tell me they're immune to something, you, you think you can just check and mark for it, you know? But I guess not. So it's either the rocks or the fucking. and eh, whatever. Chie, this can either be very useful or it will just kill you on the spot. Oh wait, no, she's 
immune to it now, right? Yeah. They're all fucking immune to ice. Jesus, fuck. Yukiko, don't die. Where's my fucking... I gotta... I gotta reorganize the shit. There we go. A rock dodge my fire. Are you... Okay. Eh, fuck it. Keep you down. Amazing, Yukiko Senpai. Two defeated so far. Go, Senpai, you rock. You weak to physical? Nope. Hey, I will take that. Thank you very much. She gets enemy radar at 52. Alright. Now, because I have invigorate and shit, I guess I'll do the healing. For right now, anyways. For the most part. Those two are immune to fire, right? Enemy down. I'm here. Time to show my skills. How about you sit the fuck That's down, Teddy? I don't care. You're not gonna help me in this situation. You hit the enemy's weakness. Ice. Weak to ice. All right. Well, I mean, I mean, I'll just. Let Shay handle that. Four enemies left. Don't give up. What the fuck? Perfect. Leave this to me. Steady. Enemy down. Let's attack with all our strength. Shay, how the fuck you miss your weakness? How how you miss that? You had one job. This whole playthrough. This whole entire playthrough. Just missing shit, and you're still alive for some reason. Kill that motherfucker. God damn it. Skill level up? I mean, I, I kind of don't want to, but at the same time, I mean... You know what? No, I'll get the key. Have I gotten a little stronger? At least we're not getting one shot. Yet, anyways. Yay, checkpoint. Warning, warning. Attention intruders, leave the facility immediately. I repeat, leave the facility immediately. Does this mean Natakun doesn't want our help? I don't really get it, but let's go on for now. Well, part of the words, get the fuck out, don't you get, Rize? You're an idol. I think you should know those words by heart now. Be careful. There's an ice immune enemy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good nice one, move, senpai. Enemy down. Right, Don't miss Chie. Can you do that for me? Thank you. Two enemies. Aha, is this our chance? Okay. Who's alive? All so of you. Persistent. Great. Good job. Add a new card, skill card, chest card, and recovery. Played a little safe. A little bit. Just a little bit. Be 
careful. There's an ice immune enemy. What are you two be against? Oh, I don't even know yet. Huh. Enemy down. Keep nice it up. move, Senpai. Enemy down. All nice right, move, keep it senpai. up. Kanchi, try electricity. Don't give up. See if that gets us anywhere. It ain't going down. Bufula? No. You're not weak to fire as well, are you? No. Huh. You're not weak to Garu either, are you just... Come the fuck on! Ah, oh, shit. That's not good. Okay, foul breath. I'll take it. Alright, yeah. Uh, try this, Kanji. No, you resistance. Great. You're the man. All right, well, I mean... Yikes, it's tough. Go for it. Ooh, can I have this one? Now you want to do a follow-up, huh? You couldn't do that with the fucking rare shadow. But it's a rock, you want to kick the rock? Okay. There's a shadow in this chest. Snuff soul. I'll take it. Won't see me complain about it. Looks like that one's immune to wind. Uh, I was thinking of letting Yukiko handle it, but. Might as well. That's the way Sentai well. do some more damage. Just get the extra damage, why not? Enemy down. All right, nice keep move, going. Senpai. And you I don't have any like darkness spells or anything, right? No. Eh. <laughs> ah, fuck it. I know you're resistant, but who cares? Oh shit! Oops. What if I just died there? That'd be embarrassing. Couldn't finish it. Oh, now you want to get a critical. When it doesn't matter. When it doesn't matter. What the fuck did you just say? Let's attack with all our strength. places, everyone. And action. Let's go, Amaterasu. Amaterasu? You don't know how to pronounce the name of your own fucking persona, Yukiko? Is that what we're doing here? I up! Hey, that pupil. It increases her chance of getting critical hits. Maybe you might be useful now, Chie. Let's see. Uh, honestly, I never really use Gale Slash. Ice boost, Mabufu, counter, counters, you know, so so, right? Terukaja, evade fire, Bufula. See, my problem here is if I do a dead pupil, get rid of Gale Slash, what am I gonna do when she gets a better, like, all attack and move? Eh, whatever. I don't really use Gale Slash. No point. It's no point for it. Oh, did I level up? Dairahan. My bad, Dairahan's tier 3, Diorama. It's tier 2, Mudun, eh. I like having an option there. Agilao, Media, Rikaram, Firebreak. 
Barbados. Honestly, Firebreak is only, like, really good for maybe two situations. Like, any type of break magic is only good for, like, maybe two situations. And one of them is, like, optional. So, you know, bye, Firebreak. I won't miss you. You can also get an item that kind of just does it, too, right? There's really no reason to have fire break. Or any of the breaks. Watch it. That one's immune to fire. I keep forgetting what the fuck you're weak to. Honestly. So I'm just gonna smack this guy. Or miss. Use fire break on Yukiko, but then you attack on <laughs> All right. Three of them. Don't give up now, okay? Torn shot. Damn. Still two of them. Two enemies down. Gotcha. It's showtime. Are you ready? All right, let's do this. Yeah, go, go, go. All right, three more, but no experience. Increase magic, deal new cards. I'll go for the magic boost. Shadow. All right. Huzzah! The stairs! Warning! Warning! Attention intruders, leave the facility immediately. I repeat, leave it immediately. Hey senpai, when Natsuku appears on the Midnight Channel, he said he was going to undergo a body alter alteration operation. Did that mean Natsuku is going to be altered here? Crap, we need to hurry. Uh-oh. Why you got to be facing me, damn it? Uh oh. Oh, that's not good. Darkness won't work. Lower her fucking accuracy. I mean, you're not really, not really making a difference there, buddy. It's already sh fucking dog shit. Ow! Not worth it. Not worth it. Not worth it. I was waiting for it. Uh, I want to say this is probably the only time in like ever playing Persona 4, like this playthrough here for the streams that I've been doing. It's the only time that I ever really got in game overs. It's not even just like one game over. It's like a bunch of them. And it's mainly just due to the fact that I'm under level this shit. Oh, of course. Of course, we get a red one right off the bat. Watch it. That one's immune to electricity. Uh huh. Yeah, that's great. That's great. Three enemies down. Our enemy oh. fight. Oh shit. Said you're immune to electricity, so. Ow! Three of them. Don't give up now, okay? Couldn't quite beat it. You're still missing, Che. What the fuck is wrong with you? Two remaining. What the hell, Yukiko? Oh my god! <laughs> Guys, Chie Senpai's really hurt. Oh, 
Congratulations on not dying, Chie. Heal her up a bit. There you go. It's weak to light. Oh, it's weak to light. Well, t the only thing we don't have. Great, thanks. I mean, we have items for it, but I'll save them, right? That one's totally oh, you're resistant to against everything else. Now, okay? Eh, fuck it. Ah, oh, come on! I could have used that for something else. Whoa, Kanji, that was great. Ah, down and die already. Ah, just kick it. Man, you guys really hate Kanji, huh? Serves him right. Yay! I leveled up. Yeah, at least we're getting close to the forty, like pretty fast. So that's a plus. Um, I got you guys. Don't worry. Heal up. Ah shit. <laughs> uh oh, that one's immune to darkness. So Wind didn't work on you before. What about fire? Eh, well. Just what I'd expect, Jay Senpai. Jesus. Senpai, keep it up. Here goes. Push it it ain't working. Damn it. Kanji, your agility has been lowered. There we go. Down. Do it again, Chie Senpai. Now we're getting somewhere. Then right on it, Chie Senpai. You're doing good. Uh were they resistant against fire? Ice. Oh, we didn't even connect it. Left. Wait. You can whip. Ice. Oh god. Yeah, I didn't even connect it. Go there. Okay. Normal die. damage. Good job, Yukiko Senpai. Let's just get rid of you. Go, senpai. You rock. Oh wait. Oh no. That's oh. Amazing. Okay, Chie. All right. All right. Okay. I saw that. Oh, did I level up? Duly noted. I was more scared of you dying from it, right? Because I died from Aeon Rain last time. Oh wait, what the fuck? Oh, I used media. Oops. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. I thought it was the big guy again. I mean, I'm not gonna... There we go. I'm here. Time to show my skill. Why not? Spin me around. Drill, baby, drill. Here goes. Push it up. Play 
take down and die already! We need to thin him out! Suzuka Gongen! We can show up too, senpai! Gotcha! Places, everyone! And... action! All hyped up and ready to go! Does that fucking bat says Atlas on it? I didn't even notice that. Alright. Oh, that's really tempting. Change to our con- which one? Which one changes? No! <laughs> that's the one I wanted! Damn it. Eh, might as well heal myself. Another level! Gotta keep at it! Attaboy, Kanji. It'd be a real shame if I just died and lost all that progress. You know, I haven't found any fucking golden chests. There's a shadow in here. No? Okay. Once the enemy gets its preemptive strike, it's over. Oh my god, thank you. <laughs> Jesus. Checkpoint. Unknown intruders have arrived at B4, at B4F. Threat level orange. Major facility areas locked. Eliminate the intruders. So, Naoto's... Honestly, I don't really like Naoto's dungeon that much. Mainly for the fact that it's not that long, honestly. I think it's one of the shorter ones, that immune to but you have to go down to level 6, I think, grab an ID card, and then run back up to level 4, if I remember correctly. Ah, shit. As long as it's not Chie, it's fine. It got back up. Defeat it fast. Spoke too soon. God damn it. All right, torn shot. Should have done on the one that was already weak. Oh my! Four of them. You need to thin them out. Don't fuck up, Jay. All right. Good job, Oh my god, the one that you had to knock down. The one that you had to knock down. You just couldn't do it, could you? You just constantly gotta disappoint me, Jay. Come on, experience, come on, experience, come on, experience. Hey, experience! Ah, uh, but then again... Some health... Uh, experience. I'll go for it. Hey, Divine Grace. I mean... it's really no reason for me to have Evade Elect. Because I'm not, like... Not, like, weak against it. So... You know. Alright, dead end. That's cool. That's fine. I'm not mad about it. I ain't worried about it. Not even thinking about it. You know what? Actually, because I got that level up, I'm just gonna run upstairs real quick. Have the game kind of like slowly checkpointed a bit. Hope I'm doing okay. Is this my first playthrough? Actually, no. <laughs> um, because now because Twitch, uh, they changed like their whole tag system, I guess. So now, oh shit, the research area is beyond this point. Entries forbidden to ordinary combatants. Okay, whatever. Um, because Twitch changed the way they do their tag system now. Before you would only be like limited to like maybe six tags, like per stream. But now there are tags that are locked in for whatever category of game you're playing. So Persona has like RPG and visual novel and simulation, all that shit is locked in. So I just kind of keep up the first playthrough tag. I keep that up. 
mainly because whenever I do stream, most of the time it is first playthroughs. But Persona 4? No. But at the same time, I know there are people that are watching who uh, haven't played Persona 4. And, you know, some people are coming hot off of Persona 5, or maybe Persona 3, or if you're lucky, Persona 2. Alright. So don't wanna, don't wanna, like, have it spoiled, alright? Pretty much that's it. And it hurts me a little bit inside because Ultimax is out and I'm like, I wanna play Ultimax! I wanna do it right now! But the moment you start that game, it's like, and spoilers! <laughs> I'm still debating in my mind, should I play P3 first before doing Ultimax? Consider playing it after you played 5, yeah. <laughs> and usually, uh, usually when I do- oh shit, wow. You guys almost died from that. Usually when I do playthroughs, I try to start from the beginning. If it's like, you know, if it's feasible. Maybe not from like, Final Fantasy 1 or anything like that, because maybe that one's a little bit too crazy. But, um... But since, you know, Persona, Persona's a, Persona's a rare breed where it's like, most people aren't gonna play Persona 1 or 2 or really care about the beginnings, right? They're gonna talk about 3, 4, and 5. So, might as well start with 4, because I think that's the easiest one for people Someone to get into with. Heal me. I can't go on. Alright, Yukiko, calm down. You don't gotta fucking play it up like that, alright? Damn, I got you. Just, you know, just be like, hey, you, man, I'm just really not feeling it, right? Instead, she's like, someone, please. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, that gave me a heart attack. Final Fantasy is fun. Give it five. Oh, that's Give it five. Good. And he was like, oh, my God, Dark you want to try the other work. ones? Yeah, Final Fant. Honestly, Final Fantasy is like four and up, really, for most people. Like, no one really plays 1, 2, or 3 unless you just really want to, like, just go back. And no one plays 2 unless you fucking hate yourself. Oh my god. Final Fantasy 2 just makes me want to cry. Because it's, it's that Final Fantasy. It's the one that's like, how do you level up? Oh. Your character has to constantly use the same move like 60 times to level up like maybe one tier. Yukiko-senpai needs help! Oh my god, can you guys like- what, what's going on here? That's the first time I've ever heard Kanji say that. <laughs> Deliver that voice line. Can you stand? Good job, Kanji. That's why we love you, buddy. Uh, I mean, there's really nothing else Kanji can do right now, honestly. It's all Chie now. Your agility has been lowered. I'll finish you. Three enemies. Here's our chance. Gotcha. They didn't even. No, no, I'm thinking about it. They didn't even fucking change it for the pixel remasters for Final Fantasy. Like for Final Fantasy 2, they still kept that stupid shit. <laughs> like I get they wanted I get they wanted it to be like fateful, but at the same time it's like maybe maybe not for Final Fantasy 2 you should have done that. It's kinda you know, it's kinda bad. At least they changed the like localization for Final Fantasy V <laughs> when it comes to those remasters. Because I have the uh, anthologies on the PS1, I have, uh, you know, Final Fantasy V and VI. And the one for V is when they have one of the characters, I forgot her name. Spoilers, by the way. She she pretends to be a dude for a while. But she ta she's supposed to talk like a pirate, so every five seconds she's like, Yaharg and Gerharg and Yaharg. Right? And she just comes off like a fucking doof. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh oh. Oh, that's not good. Darkness won't work. What are you weak against? Electricity's busted, but don't give up. I didn't hit you with physical like at all, not once. Or wind? I know you're not weak against wind. 
how far am I on this game so far? I mean, we're in Naoto's dungeon. <laughs> I mean, that, like, we're doing Naoto's dungeon. I don't know how else to. I really don't know how else to answer answer that. You know. For the most part, I try to um, I try to do the dungeons on like the first day. And the reason why I'm just having a little bit of a problem with this one is because uh, because usually between the sessions, between the sessions, I would um, you know, grind for a bit so we don't run into any complications for the stream. And I could have easily just had Yosuke and fucking Teddy help me out with this because they're, you know, they're good. They're like around level 45, which is like a good level for this place. But oh shit, I'm gonna die. Uh oh. Yukiko Senpai needs help. And honestly, Chie and Yukiko are the only ones that that like are lacking. But at the same time, Chie and Yukiko. And, and uh, Yosuke are the only ones that got their ultimates right now. Not ultimates, my bad. Ultimates? Someone please heal me. I can't go on. Ultimates. No. What is the what is the first what is the first uh change of personas called? It's not ult awaken persona. Awaken? There's awaking and then there's ultimate. Wait, no 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 no. There's ultimate and then there's prime, right? Fuck, I don't know, damn it. I guess I'm going off of Persona 2 logic, where they would just call them, like, prime versions of the Persona. Or was that Persona 1? Now I'm confusing myself. Jesus fuck. Thought it was Awakening in Persona 5? Yeah. Uh -oh. that one's immune to darkness. Yeah, that's, uh... Yeah, they, uh... Cause in, um... In original, it's... Oh shit, actually... Did they have Awakening Personas in the original Persona? I think they did. Yeah, yeah, they did. Yeah, they did. They did. And then Golden is when they added the Ultimate Personas. And then, um... And then 5, they had Awakening, and then in 5 Royal, they had their Ultimate versions of the Persona. Oh, shit. Um... I'm afraid to use wind, but fuck it. Oh, okay. Wind's good. Two well down. Keep going, senpai. No, ultimate is well. Awakening is what Yukiko and Chie have right now. It's when you max out the social link, and then ultimate is later on. They'll give you another social. Well, not social. I, I whatever. You still hang out with them. Whatever. I guess social link event. But you have to have them maxed out. And then the characters will be like, I want to hang out one more time. I still got some shit to get off my chest. And then you talk to them one more time. And then they, uh, and then their personas evolve one more time. But that only happens in, um, that only happens in Golden and in Royal. Speaking about ultimate personas, it's a fun little fact that I guess in, uh, Persona... Th Did that not hit me? Did, what do you do? Exorb it? I'm sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Oh, null? Okay, so it didn't repel? That's cool. I'll just do that again. Um... That's the way, senpai. Do some more damage. In Persona... In Persona 3... I think... I think Koromaru starts out with his ultimate Persona because he has two fucking nullifications, which is fire and darkness. And that Persona does not evolve at all. For some goddamn reason. Wind won't work. Three of them! Don't give up now, okay? It's just kind of sad, you know? It's like, the, it's like I guess the dog is so fucking pure that it just starts out with an ultimate persona. It doesn't need to learn anything else. Ooh, that was scary. You got it, Chie. Uh, she's fine. She's not gonna die. You gotta play Royal Nux. Hey, man, at least, at least you're thinking about playing the game. Most Persona 5 fans don't even have the game. <laughs> yeah, that's right, I went there. I remember, uh... I remember, like, on Twitter at some point... 
I usually try not to get into any arguments on Twitter, which I didn't, but someone made like a nice little joke and it's like the meme of like a guy like fucking climbing a bunch of steps like all at once and on it it had like all the persona games and it was persona it was like <laughs> it was just missing every persona and going straight up to five and i made like a little comment i was like that's pretty funny you're assuming that they would even play persona 5 to begin with right you know i was like haha a little bit of trolling there. And then someone got like really mad at that comment for some reason. That's not good. Dark and they were like, well, I pirated the game because I don't have a PlayStation and I can't buy it. And I'm like, well then, I mean, I'm assuming you have another game console that you bought to also buy other, to also play other games that you bought. So... Like, I didn't reply to the guy, but I'm just looking at it, and I'm like, Nah, that doesn't make sense to me. Now's your chance. And it's like, you, don't, you really don't need to... I'm like, you really don't need to, uh... You honestly really don't need to play the game if it's that serious. I mean, isn't... Is Persona 5 on Steam? Well, even if it wasn't on Steam, like... It's also on PS3, and when Persona 5 came out, you could still get a PS3 for fucking dirt cheap. Like... Like, come on, man. You know, I understand if it was like... If it was like Shantae for the Game Boy Color, and it's like... Getting a physical copy of that is like 300 plus nowadays, but like fucking... It's like, dude... It's not that serious. Also, I didn't attack anybody for pirating the game, even though you really shouldn't. Right? I don't know. It's a it's a gray area to talk about, like, you know, pirating and fucking, uh... And, like, uh, emulation. But for the most part, it's like, you know, contribute to the damn thing if you like it. If they put the game on Switch, I'll buy it. But you didn't buy it when it was on PS4 or PS3. I'm assuming you spent over 300 bucks, like three around 300 or maybe 350 to get a Switch that you're supposedly gonna buy a new version of Persona 5 on. So kicking it up to like 400. Meanwhile, you could have spent a total of like 160 to get a PS3 and a copy of Persona 5. That's all I'm saying. Uh, you know, logic is logic, but whatever. Whatever, man. <laughs> like all I know is I just I just stood at the guy who replied to me, and I like I didn't even I didn't even reply to. It. I just looked at it. And I was like, that doesn't make sense to me. To me, it's just like, I stole it because I wanted it. It's not like the Wii U right now, where Nintendo's like, fuck you, we're not backing this shit up, so we're just gonna... We're just gonna say, no, you can't have Wii U games anymore. That one I can say, alright, go ahead, pirate. But even me saying that, I went out my way and I bought physical versions of those games. The only game I gotta buy for the Wii U now is Yoshi's Woolly World because I bought a copy and for some reason it worked, but then the next day it didn't. So I'm like, what the fuck is the deal with that? So, you know, and like the disc itself isn't marked up or anything like that. It just stopped working for some reason. I don't know why. So it's that I gotta buy. And then what's the other Wii U game? Uh... 007 Legends, which is not a good game, but it's the only 007, uh, only version of 007 Legends that has the Skyfall DLC on the disc. Oh, that's not good. Darkness you know? won't work. Persona 5 isn't on Steam, but Striker, wait. Persona 5 isn't on Steam. Strikers is, but not the game It's wait, what? Strikers is, but not the game itself. What do you mean? Wait, what? What do you mean? 
What does that mean? <laughs> I'm confused now. <laughs> there's a person. I know there's a person. Okay. So the game Strikers is on there. I know it's like that. I have the game. <laughs> I have a physical copy. But the way you wrote it is Strikers is, but not the game itself. So it confused me the way you worded that. I was like, wait, what? So you tell me like the DLC for Strikers is on there, but not the game? You gotta go to fucking Goodwill Games, some shit? Good old games, GOG, whatever the fuck it's called. Yeah, fucking. When I was playing uh, Strikers on my own time, I was skipping the story. I was skipping it because I was like, well, I want to do a playthrough of it, but at the same time, I just really want to play it to see how it controls. And then I kept playing it because it was really good. And then. Persona's not really a hard story to follow, so even with me skipping the cutscenes, I still kind of got what was going on, so I'm like, uh, whatever, ma'am. You got a Kanzu, hit him again. Woke up an hour ago, still waking up in the UK. <laughs> That's fine. Oh, yes! Give me it. Delicious experience. It's beautiful. It's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my life. Come on, give me the... Give me the steps. Yes! Is this the last floor? <clears throat> I think floor 6 is the last floor for Naoto. You grab... You do the mini-boss. You grab the uh, ID and then you head back up to floor 4. Mini boss should be this way. Oh shit, of course, of course. Alright. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I don't wanna fight. Not yet, anyways. Oh, I done fucked myself over. Come through, excuse me. Jump, excuse. Oh, fucking fuck. You stay over there. You're not welcomed. Stay over there. This is the first time first time watching, so it's cool for you to decide if you're gonna get Persona 4 or not. Oh. So this is your first experience to Persona 4. Okay. I'm gonna assume that you don't care too much for spoilers. Maybe a little bit. Maybe not maybe that much. But I would say we're maybe after this dungeon, I would say you're entering like the third. I guess for comparisons, after this dungeon is when Haru would join the party, right? And you're like, oh. <laughs> you're like, oh, only like a couple of dungeons left, huh? The last character has joined the party. That beautiful, brilliant forehead? Oh shit! Uh-oh, uh-oh, oh no, oh no, oh no, uh-oh, 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 I done fucked up. Uh-oh. Oh my god, Chie and Yuki. Really low on health. What gave that away, Rize? Okay, I'll look for an opening. Chie Senpai, your agility Do I gotta down. fucking forget her agility? She's on death's door, man. Vanish ball. Oh, thank god. Get me the fuck out of there. Wow. Okay. Oh my stars. Oh, that wasn't good. That was not, that was not a fun experience. Boom. Boom. Damn, Chie. You really hurting over there. Maybe that was a little overkill. Um, I have... Where the hell are my... Oh, here they are. I'm blind. Snuff Soul. I guess I'll get one of Chie. Mm. Beyond this point is confidential. Entry is forbidden for ordinary combatants and researchers. Please present your ID. Oh shit, yeah. Okay. Did you start a stream or have I been streaming for a while? I have been streaming for three and a half hours. <laughs> 
Actually, that reminds me to look at the time because I did say I had a couple of ooh. I'm pretty much on time for for where I would usually end the stream. I'll, I'll squeeze out a couple more minutes. Maybe we get to oh shit. Oh no. Oh no. No. Hang in there. There goes experience. You're up. Time for a counter attack. All right. Okay. Hold up. Wait a minute. Okay, listen, Chie, I'm gonna need you. I'm gonna need you to be on your fucking best behavior. You got that? Physical damage to all may cause exhaustion. Gale slash physical damage. Let's at least get one, maybe two. Oh! I forgot, you played Persona 5! <laughs> In Persona 5, they went back to how... Persona, they borrowed a lot from Persona 1 and 2, in which the enemies themselves were the uh, personas you would get, like the demons you would talk to to join your team that you would then fuse and stuff. And Persona 3 and 4, and like all the other spinoffs and shit, the enemies you fight are shadows. And you wouldn't get your, the only way you would get personas is either through getting them after the fight, which like, you know, a card would drop and you pick up whatever the fuck. Or, um, or you just fuse them, right? Yeah, yeah, that's why, that's why there's a lot of, that's why instantly a lot of Persona 2 fans hopped on Persona 5 and went, Oh my god, but Persona 2 is better, right? Because it borrowed a lot from Persona 2, but Persona 2 borrowed a lot from SMT, because Persona is a spin-off series of SMT that is more popular than the main series that is SMT. But whatever. <laughs> you know? Uh, fuck him up while he's down. Oh! You got counter. No, I can't. <laughs> no, I cannot. Oh, no. Counter's not a good thing to have. Alright, yep. We're done. We're done. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. Look for an opening. Get me the fuck out of here. Get me out of here. Get me out of here right now. Nope, not doing it. Not worth it. I don't got no Almighty. I don't have Hasotobi. It's it's over. I'm gonna play SMT, but there's the remaster that came out in the UK. Oh, shit. If you're talking about if you're talking about Nocturne, for, for me, for the most part, I don't have as much experience as SMT as a bunch of SMT fans would like. But I have played Nocturne, which is the one that, which is, there are two, two, there are three SMT games that SMT fans never shut the fuck up about. It is Nocturne, oh my god, they never shut the fuck up about Nocturne. Uh, SMT 4, because some people like it, some people hate it. And then SMT, uh, the Raido Kusanoha shit, because it's just a bunch of weird shit. Fucking, if you're talking about the Nocturne remaster, for fuck's sake, for your own enjoyment, please do not make Nocturne your first experience to SMT. Oh my fucking god, please don't make it your first experience to SMT. I get the reasons why people like that game, I honestly do. And there are good reasons to like that game, but as a game itself, it is full of nothing but bullshit, it is completely flawed, and the only way you're gonna love that game, really, is if you really, really like the story, which isn't really much of a story, it's more of an idea, right? Just hang on, I'll find you an opening. You know? Like, and if you're gonna play SMT Nocturne, honestly, if you're, if you don't care too much about it, just play it on easy mode. Just play it on the easiest mode possible. Fuck it. Like, honestly, normal mode is just too annoying. Because the game itself is not even- it's not even a hard game, it's just that the design of it is complete bullshit. Like, just dumb, fucking, stupid shit. Three of them. Don't give up now, okay? Rize, can you let us escape, please? I'm waiting on you. Now's your chance. Thank you.
You wait, you wait till they bring more out in the UK. Yeah, fucking... Like, SMT, SMT is one of those things, well, at this point in time, because Nintendo's shutting down the fucking eShop for the 3DS and stuff like that. At this point in time, I would be like, alright, if you want to pirate those games and just emulate them, go ahead. Go ahead, doesn't matter. They already gave up on making money for that. Uh, I'm pretty sure Atlas doesn't care about it either at this point because they're worrying about the next stuff that they're doing, right? So, you know, that's all fair game. <laughs> if they were actively making money on it, then it would be like, all right, all right, wait, you know. Also, SMT, here's the stupid thing about fucking Nocturne Remaster. Um, if you want, like, if you want a quicker way to like level up and stuff like that and get money which you might be hurting for in that game because it is again a flawly designed game you gotta buy the dlc for that you gotta buy the dlc for that shit which is really weird because that's really weird because in smt5 the game that is the actual new game you don't have to buy the dlc to get the level up grimoires and shit I don't think you do anyways. Maybe you do. I don't know, but it's it's just weird. It's weird especially because there's that, and then there's Tokyo Mirage Session, which is SMT Cross Fire Emblem. And in that game, you don't have to fucking get the DLC for the Grimoires. It's... I don't know. They did that shit super weird. Uh... I'm scared of the shadow. I'm gonna run past you. I'm trying to get to the mid-boss. Oh, out of the way, sir, my good friend. Oh, God. Oh, no. You just... You just gonna... You just gonna... You just gonna pretend that I'm not here? Won't see me complain about it. See ya. That's cool. <laughs> oh, but you remembered I was there. So, I have to ask, because mainly, I know when it came to... I want to ask, did, um, in the UK, did Room Factory 5 come out? In the UK? Because for some reason... When... What are you weak against, when? Okay, I'll hit you with ice. Um... Because for some reason, when Room Factory 4 came out... You know, it came out a year early, like everything does in Japan, and then it came out a year later in North America. But then, for some reason, I knew that Europe had to wait, like, another year to get the localization for Rune Factory 4. Which is weird, because, you know, most of the languages spoken in Europe was already in the North American version of Rune Factory 4, so... I don't know what the fuck happened with that. I couldn't do it. And because the 3DS was region locked, it's like... Okay... You know? It was kind of weird. Arvati! Three enemies down! Here, let's do it! It's showtime! I'm gonna get you. Alright, let's do this! Go! Beat him up! Good job, team. Ah, shit. What again? Three more enemies for you. All right, it's the same guys. Not too worried about it. Don't know what that game is. You just typed into Google and, it, and uh, looks like it's out. Localization, imagine some weird laws and censorship. But there was nothing to really censor in New Factory Four, so I don't know why it took them a fucking year to put it out in the in Europe. It was so weird. Do you have counter? Whoa, it's a doozy. Oh, you don't have counter. Okay, cool. Oh, wait. No, never mind. Shit. I'm an idiot. Speaking of UK versions and shit like that, like different regional versions, I remember when I was, uh, I'm still kind of collecting older games and stuff like that. Um, and I remember I was getting stuff for the PS3, and one of them I was getting was the Tomb Raider collection. 
And then I bought it, you know, bought it directly from Square Enix thinking it was all good, you know. And then it came in the mail and I looked at the corner of it and I was like, what the fuck is this like weird red circle rating shit right here? And I'm looking at it, I'm like, I'm like, did I just, is this the fucking German version of Tomb Raider? <laughs> What's going on here? So apparently I got a I got a, a Germany version of fucking Tomb Raider anniversary collection or whatever the fuck on the PS3. It still controls good. I don't I don't think there was that I don't think there were any changes to it really, honestly. But fucking I was just I was confused as fuck. Cause I usually try to be careful for that stuff, especially when getting games like Lollipop Chainsaw and stuff like that. Like, when you try to get them off of eBay, everyone's like, I'm selling this for, like, half the price that it's going for. And you're like, that's cool. And they're like, but it's the Japanese version. I'm like, all right. Not gonna buy that one. Oh, shit. Watch it. That one's immune to electricity. I played a little bit of Lollipop Chainsaw when it came in the mail, right? And I was like, let me see. I'm sure this game is as crazy as people is like losing their minds over. And then I got to the first boss and I was like, oh. Okay. <laughs> I was like, okay. I'll save that for a playthrough one day. I'm just gonna put that in the corner and pretend it doesn't exist. That first boss left an impression on me. For an example. You know, minor spoilers for Lollipop Chainsaw, but like, for example, um, I don't need a leg break. Well, I got Fatal, I got Fatal and Cool Attack, so I mean, I can switch it out. Um, for like a little spoiler, the first boss is like this, the main enemies you're fighting are like zombies and shit. And it's this punk rock zombie dude that you're fighting, and he has the ability, like he's like super metal and shit. So his ability is that, like, he'll fucking... Oh, shit. Is it floor four that I have to do the fight on? Oh, shit, I think it might be floor four. Oh, no. I've been running around in circles for no fucking reason. God damn it. Um... He's like a super metal fucking, like, punk dude, you know, got the spiky mohawk and everything. And his ability is that when he does his screamo shit, like, the words that he yells fucking manifest themselves and he uses them as projectiles. And the fight starts, and the first thing he yells is, FUCKING BITCH! And then, you see those big-ass words coming towards you, and I went, okay. I was like, Jesus, alright. Made your voice heard. You don't fancy lollipop chainsaw, so go ahead. It's actually not as raunchy as you, well, I mean, it's a little raunchy, right? But it's not as raunchy as you expect it to be. Like on average, I would say something like Saints Row the Third is dirtier than that game. Excuse me, coming through. Where the fuck are the steps? Come on. Floor four. Right? Gotta find the uh the mini boss on this floor, I think. Don't fancy Saints Row either? Yeah. I don't fancy the new Saints Row. <laughs> to be honest. I mean I don't care that much about Saints Row to begin with. I really don't care that much about Grand Theft Auto or anything like that either. You know, they're fun to play, but well, the single player is, anyways. But, like... I just did a big-ass circle, because I got scared of this fucking shadow chasing me. I don't want to fight it. Can you stop? Can you, like... Go! Shoo! Go away! Get! Get! Are you gonna... Are you gonna... Thank you. <laughs> what the fuck? Um, I lost my train of thought. Oh no. I think this is the boss, right? 
The research area is beyond this point. Entries forbidden in ordinary combatants. Please present your ID. Oh, fuck. Where the fuck do I get it, then? What the fucking... Hold up. Move to the next floor. Fuck you. Fast travel. Um... I think I... It must be on the sixth floor, then. Like, one of the... Oh, shit. It's one of the treasure chests down there. God damn it. Oh! I got stuck in the corner. Alright, it's okay. As long as you don't... Alright, Foolish Whispers. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. And you missed anyways. Rampage. Alright, that's cool. Give me the fuck out of here, Riza. Riza, get me out of here. Riza? Thank you. Now's your chance. Run. I lost my train of thought. I was talking about fucking Saints Row and some bullshit. Oh yeah, um, I don't really care for those games that much, honestly. Especially Red Dead, I just really don't like Red Dead. It's kind of boring. But, I love Mafia though. Mafia was great. Not Mafia 3. But like, looking at the new Saints Row, I'm like, oh. It's a game about a bunch of TikTokers. Okay. <laughs> but I also find it super hilarious because a lot of people are complaining about it. And it's like, you really don't get to complain about a new Saints Row game because your last game that you got was fucking Agents of Mayhem. So be happy that it even exists. <laughs> be happy that you don't get another Agents of Mayhem, okay? I remember somebody attacked me because I said that. They were like, bro, that's not even funny. That fucking game almost bankrupted the company. And I'm like... Exactly why you shouldn't be complaining that the new Saints Row game isn't that game. Now's your chance. Run! Your own logic didn't make sense there. What the fuck? <laughs> it's like, you don't know what you're talking about. Yukiko-senpai, you're low on health! Damn, she is low on health. She's almost dead. Legally dead. Uh, I gotta find the, um... Ah, oh, fucking damn it. I just don't want to fight them. Even though I should be, because I need the experience. Oh yeah, that's the door that's locked. Fuck. One of these chests has the card. Take a wide turn. Yeah, that's right. I did it. Like I said, Naoto's dungeon, I don't like that much because it requires you to backtrack and do some bullshit. The map is confusing? Uh, not really. Fucking, there are some floors that are not... For the most part, you know how like in Persona 5 you have mementos and that was like auto-generated? There are some floor... Most of the dungeon is like this. It's a big-ass hallway in Persona 4. So Persona 4's dungeons are definitely... The least parts of it. That's why they did the whole palace shit in Persona 5, because they, because people complained that there was no design to the dungeons in Persona 4, which they're not wrong for, right? Um. Okay, I'll look for an opening. But there are some floors that are not randomly generated. They have a certain layout. So like floor four and six in this dungeon, like they have their certain layout. Like it will never change. But you also get abilities to read the map. So, what button is it? I keep pressing that button for the map. God damn it. So, like, the map clears out where you go, right? The fucking... The uh, white squares are doors, and the stars are treasure chests. So, it gets to the point where you get to see the stars, like, on your little mini-map in the corner before you go into the room, so you already know that most of the time that's gonna be a dead end. Research card. There we go. Now I gotta head to floor four, fight the mini-boss, and... And here's another thing. You heard that, that sound of the chains? I'm not sure if you ran into the Persona, Persona. I'm not sure if you ran into the enemy in um, P5, but that's the Reaper. In Persona 3, 4, and 5, they introduced the Reaper concept, which if you spend too long on a floor within the dungeons, you know, unless you were in a palace in Persona 5, um, not that research card, uh, you would hear the shackles going and then if you hung around too long the reaper would show up and he's a super powerful ass enemy that you will stand no chance against unless you are playing a new game plus 
You never met the Reaper? Fun thing about the Reaper and the Persona 4 anime, the original Persona 4 anime, not Golden. Is it Golden? Actually, I think it might have been Golden, now that I think about it. I'm not sure. Probably was Golden. Um... Alright, so you see how there's two stars there? I'm not gonna go that way because chances are it's just gonna branch into like a split path with two chests at the end of it. So I'm gonna ignore that passage and just go this way instead. Um... And the Persona... Probably in the Persona 4 Golden anime. Uh, when they confront the culprit... The culprit summons a bunch of Reapers for the... For all the other characters to fight by themselves, so each character takes a Reaper to themselves. It's pretty cool. Oh! Uh... The Reaper never changes design in any uh, Persona game, by the way. Mother... I keep hitting that corner too early. Uh-oh, that immune to darkness. Oh, come on. You okay, Senpai? Hang in there. You're fine. You're fine, Yukiko. Shake it off. You're fine. You're Time for a counterattack. Okay, I'll look for an opening. <laughs> Guys, Chie Senpai. Now's your chance. Thank you, Riza. I just kind of want to go up against the uh, the mid boss and see if I can survive Someone, the onslaught. I can't go on. All right, give me give me a chance, you can go. All right, I'm only one guy. Maybe if you did some fucking pull ups while I was uh, you know, running around with the other guys. See, and this is why in later RPG series, your teammates get leveled up even if they're not in the party. So you don't gotta deal with this shit. And this is a dead end, because there's nothing but a chest over there. Fuck me. Uh-oh, that one's immune to darkness. Shouldn't someone heal Yukiko? Eh, fuck it. What are you weak against? I'm gonna try fire. Oh my god, fucking blue wall, you gotta be kidding me. Three of them. Don't give up now, okay? Well, you just made my life worse. Here goes. Persona! Enemy down. <laughs> Don't Show lose your head. head, Kanji. Persona! Enemy defeated. Keep up the good work, Kanji. Come on. Chie, you're supposed to get the follow-up and kick that motherfucker in the stratosphere. What are you doing, girl? Might as well kill him. There we go. That looked like it hurt. Yukiko, give it a shot. Oh, you're the one that was immune to it. Shouldn't someone heal Yukiko Senpai? Senpai, shut up. <laughs> I'm sorry, Ize. I'm sorry. I'm a little frustrated. Okay, I'm a little, a little agitated. You still got that fucking wall up? One. I think he does. Go in with the torn shot. It ain't going down. All right. Ah, shit. Two reinforcements on the enemy side. What the fuck are you even weak against? Oh my god. Not wind. Oh no. No, 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 no. I shouldn't even be doing this. Here goes. Persona! It ain't going down! Two enemies left. Don't lower your guard now. Someone finish it off! Yuki, please. Fire. Now. So what persistent. the- No. 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 All right. Okay. Uh... I'm not weak to that, am I? Alright. Physical? Well, I missed, so... Goodbye, Kanji! Come on, suck it up. Injured? That man's dead. His soul was ripped out of his chest. 
Why the fuck am I fucking around with these guys? And that's why you have Mudo on Yuki. Oh, shit. That was stressful. Avoid encounters. Let's do that. Can we do that? Cool. Black spot. <laughs> that's what my mom called me when I was a child. <laughs> That was stupid. That was a stupid joke. Deals medium physical damage to one foe. Alright, so get rid of Assault Dive. I uh, like how one of the Personas look like they could have been out of Star Wars. Oh, you mean Chies? Yeah, 100%. F fucking literally just have a lightsaber. A oh, you didn't see um their Personas before? Okay, so Yukiko and Chie, they both have their ultimates. Oh, ultimates, my bad. They're awakened personas right now, but originally they both have two personas that look like fucking Sentai Rangers. Yukiko had a pink one, and Chie had a yellow one. It's level up time. Um. Oh shit. There we go. Yukiko, can you rub Kanji's back? Tell him everything's gonna be okay. Even though it might not be. Snuff soul to me. Okay. So I took a wrong turn somewhere. Alright. Oh, I see. So the pathway at the bottom is gonna loop around to the left and it's gonna go to that other star, so damn it. Sometimes you're right, sometimes you're wrong. Shit. Sometimes you gotta predict what the map's gonna be, and sometimes you're wrong. So instead of this being two pathways, like two branching pathways that lead to both chests, it's just gonna lead to one chest, I think, and the other one's gonna turn on a corner. And if that doesn't happen, then I'm a failure. Then I'm not as smart as I believe I am. Alright. Nope, they both lead to- I was right the first time, damn it! So now I gotta go all the fuck the way down here. It's very few times that you get fucked over by the Persona 4 map design. And the stairs is just right here, god damn it. Alright. Now we just gotta find that locked door. On this floor. Okay, I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go up. This loops around. Big-ass circle I just went in. That's cool. I'm just gonna go over here. Excuse me. Coming through. And this is why everybody loved the palaces from Persona 5. <laughs> these fucking hallways. I'd rather run through these goddamn hallways than deal with Tartarus. Oh my fucking god, I hate Tartarus so much. Here it is. Research beyond this point. ID. Research card. Hey, you guys want to fight a Gundam? Let's fight a Gundam. Let's do that. Uh-oh. Oh wait, no, we're going. We're, we're good. For now. Turn this way. A Gundam! Be careful, I sense a strong presence beyond this door. Open the door? Fuck yeah. Hey! Intruder detected within research area. Elimination proceeding. Alright. I think this guy uses- yep. That one's immune to darkness. He uses power charge. So, I think you're weak to... No, I'm thinking of thinking of something else. I don't think you're weak to win, I think you're weak to fire. Nope, you're weak to win, probably, One most likely, go. maybe. Keep it up. Here goes Persona! Lay down and die already! 
Uh-oh. Oh. Oof. Oh. Oh, Yuki and Chie are not... ...not surviving this. Well... Well, you can heal me up, Yuki. Actually... No, you can heal me, Yuki. <laughs> Uh-oh. Yeah, I can see that. Oh, you're not weak to anything. Careful, guys. You're really low on health. Okay. Well, he's gonna have to use power charge again first. Um. To one ally. Come on, I know I have... I know I have something that blocks all. Come on, Magic Mirror? Shit. Alright, well, I'm gonna give it to me, because I'm special. I'm a special boy. Uh, you guys are going to die. That's fine, though. Ain't no way Chie and Yukiko are surviving this, unless they dodge it. Um... I guess I can kind of help you out with that, maybe? What is this? Okay, where is... Entire party? Maybe you'll dodge, maybe you won't. Let's see what happens. Oof. Damn, Yukio just wasn't fast enough. Okay. That's fine. Get a crit, GA. That's what you're here for. Damn it. Switching personas would not be a good idea for me right now. Kanji? Oh, this isn't good. Highly underleveled. That was 150. 150. 150. Damn it, dog. How many revival be- Oh, I got one. Yeah, no, fuck that. <laughs> yeah, you're dead. <laughs> you're dead, girl. Um, I guess the smart move would be to just- Guard, right? I mean, it's there for a reason. We can play it super safe that way. Just taking low and slow. Have Kanji attack. While I heal. Let's see. Maybe get a crit in there. God damn it, Kanji. Not the most entertaining gameplay ever, but you know, hey. Serviceable. See? Actually, Chie, I think I have an assault signal. So. Come on, Kanji, get that crit, baby. I'll help you out with that. There you go. There you go, Kanji. You might die from this, Chie. She ain't getting up, bro. <laughs> she down. <laughs> she down for the count. <laughs> it's over. I brought both my girlfriends into the fight with me and they both died. 
Oh my. Damn it. Come on, Kanji. I need you. I got that. Oh fuck! No, you don't. God damn it. <laughs> She's mad dead. She dead ass is. Also, welcome you. Welcome you, Narakami. I'll try not to let you die. <laughs> See, this is why I grind before the fucking streams. But hey, you know what? As long as fucking Domo Origato and Mr. Roboto don't try no fancy shit, we're good. Damn, we better not. Exactly, right? Get a fucking critical, Kanji! Come on! Oh my fucking god. Rize, can you tell me something real quick? 300 SP? That's like forever. <laughs> That's forever, man. Alright. Rakunda's still up? No. Why does Rakunda keep going down? I guess maybe... I guess maybe we're just spending too much goddamn time, right? <laughs> Living your legacy? I'll try it. There you go. As long as we have above, like, 80 health, we shouldn't die. Okay, above 90 health, we shouldn't die. <laughs> Motherfucker did 86. He said, you sure about that? He said, 80 health, huh? Put that theory to rest real quick. Oh my fucking god. You know, I could just go and grab, like, Yosuke and Teddy real quick, and just, like, do this. Fuck, man. Alright, above 100 health, since now you want to be doing 91. Jesus, fuck. Kanji, you missing? Really don't help me that much. <sighs> Damn it. I'm gonna have to... I don't even have anything for my own fucking... Oh, I got soul tomatoes. Okay, well. Start munching on the tomato. That's cool. Do I got any revive items? I do, but but fucking Chie and um Chie and Yukiko are so goddamn weak. They're so underleveled that reviving them is just gonna not be worth it, honestly. It's not gonna it's not gonna be worth it at all. I'm just too... I'm just too stubborn to die. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> you got insomnia eyes last night? Jesus. Don't even think that's a word. It is now. It might be a word in the dictionary of low tier god. Tim repeating. <laughs> I'm sorry, I watched the compilation today. I don't know why I did it to myself, but I watched the compilation of fucking Low Tier God, and the dude was saying like the stupidest shit ever. Hmm. Should get this on Steam, but not sure if you played on your laptop. 
I mean... Persona, Persona 4 Golden is a PS Vita game that's just a remaster of a PS2 game, so it shouldn't be that bad. By the way, if you get the Steam version, at some point it's gonna stutter no matter what. That is not your computer doing that. You know, unless it's like super hard stuttering. That is not your computer doing that, that's just how the port is for a PC version of Persona 4, but I mean, I'd rather have that than not have it at all. How trash is your laptop? It can't be that trash, right? If you got like a basic bitch Chromebook, it should should work. Come on, we're almost there. This is what happens when you have someone that plays Final Fantasy XIV. Like, play a losing situation. <laughs> um... What am I doing? I lost my- I lost my train of thought for a moment. You still got- Ah, fuck it. I got enough. You can play Gmod Left 4 Dead 2 and don't start together with no problems. Oh, well then, yeah, you can play Persona 4 Golden, no fucking problem, dude. Left 4 Dead is way more intensive than Persona 4 Golden. It ain't going down. Oh my god, dude. Can you run out of fucking SP for me, please? Gotta get back to Final Fantasy XIV. It costs you 24 for one month member. What the fuck? Cost you 24? What? What'd you do? Buy extra retainers? Damn, couldn't finish it. Oh, now he's weak. Uh, -uh. did he power charge? I wasn't paying attention. Did he power charge? No. You're not fooling me. Oh, shit! Don't die! Yes, we won! Congrats, guys! My dude literally did a fucking chaozu and did nothing. Like, I napped that shit. He said, goodbye, Tien! Kaboom! And then me and Kanji looked at each other and said, what the fuck was that? That did less damage than the fucking Herculean Strikes. Twenty-four for just standard one month? No. 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 You got some extra retainers or some shit on your fucking account, or someone played your shit and got some extra retainers for you. Cause a standard a standard monthly subscription for that is fifteen bucks, my friend. Realize it's a HP skill, not a MP skill. Yeah, I know that. But he uses Power Charge to charge it up, and he has 300 SP. And Power Charge takes like, what, 12 SP to use? <laughs> Guard Gang be like, yeah, exactly. This is too much. I can't go on like- I love how I just- I love how I just shut her up. I'm like, alright, Jay, that's cool. Shut up. Research card. Alright, well. You know what? A part of me wants to finish this with Chie and Yukiko, but guess what? That shit ain't happening. Ain't no fucking way. And I mean, I didn't think I would finish the dungeon by this stream because I am over time for streaming right now. But you know what? Fuck it. Might as well finish the dungeon, right? So just gonna pop some of these bad boys. Where, where are they? Where the fuck are my go homes? I got one! Saved it for a rainy day, baby. Cool. Yeah, return to the entrance, that's fine. Actually, you know what? I didn't have to do that shit. Take me back. Take me somewhere. One month membership is like... $12.99. Yeah, about. Converted to Australian dollars is like 24 Oh, you're in Australia. Oh. Well, yeah, if you're talking about American dollars, then yeah. 
shit. <laughs> Kanji, you're with us. Um, Yosuke. You're gonna replace Chie, and naturally, you will replace Yukiko, because you got healing bullshit. Now, the only problem with this is that Yosuke and Teddy share the same fucking weakness, so it's gonna be a pain in the ass. Especially for the Naoto fight. But you don't know anything. Hey. Alright. Fox. I'm fucking money bags out here. Look at that. Thank you. I will take that. Alright. Time to rotate those saves. And just because I can. Let's see what persona we can get for this fight. Fusing it up, baby. Oh, hold up. Before I do that, gotta be smart. Off screen, I'm also gonna have to do Elizabeth's bullshit. Only one persona needs to be registered. That's cool. Hmm, let's see. Let's see. It goes from euros to Australian pounds. You pay a lot more because fuck you, apparently. <laughs> Shit. Dungeon's not actually that long. I know, it's not. That's what I said that earlier, where it's like, I don't like Naoto's dungeon, even though it's kind of the shortest one. 47. Weak to ice. Okay, I'm gonna go. Alright. You learn Agidai, and that's cool. What are you weak against? Okay, wait. You repel physical. Alright, that's cool. You're weak to physical, which is the dumbest shit ever. 44, Gabriel, Empress. I'm not really gonna get anything from Empress. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Emperor, not really gonna get anything from that hero. Repel electricity, weak against fire. Zionga, elect boost. Hmm. <laughs> uh, let me see. But maybe it wasn't for you because you're over leveled. No, the dungeon, like I was saying, the dungeon is not that long. I got sidetracked because I was thinking about Persona. The um, dungeon's not that long. It's just that you got to backtrack for it, which makes it annoying for me, honestly. I'd rather have a long dungeon than backtrack. All right. Another reason why you hate Australia. The blue room with the long nose, Yandere in the middle. <laughs> She's not a Yandere. Because she doesn't kill for you. She's a... What's the other one? There's like multiple versions. What is it? Like a, a, a Kundere? A Yundere? The one that fucking... A Sundere? She's Sundere. She's Sundere. Yeah, that, that one. Because there's, there's one that's like, she's too cool for you and acts like she acts like you're not there, but she cares. And then there's the Sundere, which is like, fucking, she's angry at you all the goddamn time. I mean, I can still do shit for Chariot. Weak against electricity. Oh, no, I'm not having three party members weak against electricity. That ain't happening. No fucking way. Hermit? Null two of them. Weak against fire. Foolish whispers. What the hell? You only get one goddamn... Okay, there we go. Hold up. Power charge counter. Power charge to what? To fucking poison arrow? Okay, hold up. This, this seems good. 33. 34. Okay. Well, then I get the boost to Zionga. What can I get from you? Oh, I can get everything. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's it. We're doing that. Rakunda, that's a staple. Uh, regenerate invigorate because I'm an asshole. I'm gonna get Zionga. I'm gonna have Teddy be the healer. Might be a stupid move, but I'm gonna have him do it. Bafula would be nice to have. Hmm. -mm. Yeah, Bafula. Because I'm just using it for the boss fight, really. You love backtracking. Well, I mean, it depends. If it's like Symphony of the Night, then yeah. Unless it's the fucking Upside Down Castle, that dumb bullshit. Well, Margaret stays in mill. Yeah. I mean, Margaret's cool, but listen. Elizabeth gang all day. I'm sorry, that's just what's happening here. 
I want my girl fucking running up the escalator like a fucking moron. Like she ain't got no goddamn brain cells. It satisfies your perfectionist traits because it confirms that you didn't miss anything. Oh yeah, that's true. Foolish Whispers wasn't called Careless Whispers. <laughs> It's an amazing move. You always run Teddy. I usually don't run Teddy, actually. Resist fire. Why the f- Why would I need resist fire if I already- Oh, wait, no. My bad. I'm sorry. I thought I thought it said I nullify fire. Okay, yeah, no. Get rid of, uh... Get rid of fucking Foolish Whispers. I mean, yeah, use it for Poison Arrow, but I'm not gonna poison the goddamn boss. Not in Golden. No way. Yeah. I mean, Teddy is supposed to be, like, better than Yukiko out the get-go, right? But when you keep with Yukiko, she learns shit like Salvation and all that other crazy shit. And fucking, what is it called? Burning Ash or whatever? Like, Yukiko is the superior healer to Teddy. It's just that Teddy comes out the woodwork with, like, stronger healing spells, but... Teddy's mostly used for, like... Teddy's mostly used for, like, buffing your party. All right, take me to Nanto. Now I'm gonna have to run my ass all the way back down to the to the sixth floor. Ah, oh, shit. Before we go in, Teddy, I think I have these for you. I haven't found any fucking golden. Oh shit. You know what's gonna happen? Actually, real quick. Burning ass. <laughs> What's gonna happen real quick is I'm just gonna save over this, mainly because I'm gonna fight Naoto now, but when the stream is over, I'm gonna have to actually reload and then... and then come back and grab a fucking peach seed and then fight Naoto again. <laughs> Continue from floor 5, yes. Salvation is cool, but all Teddy still gets is me and and Materu Kaja. Yeah, but you can teach yourself Matera- well, I mean... Can teach yourself Matera Kaja, but I mean, at the same time, you can just also teach yourself Marukanda. Hey, girls! We're just talking about- I did not mean to swing at you, I'm sorry. Encourage her. Meet Gum. What about you? Feel free to use it. Chewing Soul. This is why you're useless to me, Chie. I'm gonna fight... You mean I'm gonna fight HIM twice?! Yeah, I guess, yeah, we're, we're close to anyways, let's... Eh, yeah, forget it. Naoto's a girl, guys. Just in case you didn't know, Naoto's a chick. <laughs> that means I get to put my penis in that. I mean, even if Naoto was a dude, I still get to put my penis in that. Consensually, of course. Legally, of course. Oh, wait, wait. I got flipped turned upside down for a moment. It scared me. A. See? Meat gum is fucking nasty. Why would you do that if you can just keep charging and hitting with Teddy? Because... I don't know. <laughs> I mean, you can do that. But I mean, wouldn't you rather have the extra move to heal instead- Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Where's the door? Someone help me. Oh, no. Oh, no. I trapped myself. Oh, no. This is dead end. Soul drop! Drop top! Need to heal every round? I know you Look don't. Out. It's immune to physical attacks. I'd rather have... I'd rather... You know, it's one of those games where it's like... You choose your moves, and then something can easily get fucked up. And you're like... Well, I might as well heal this round instead of fucking... I guess it's mainly because I'm just scared. It's built into me from Persona 3. From Mitsuru just refusing to help me. 
while I'm on the floor bleeding. And then Junpei going like, and Junpei just going like, what's that? The enemy's fucking immune to physical attacks? I'll just hit it with my sword. What's that? You want me to use Blade of Fury? No, Junpei. No, I don't. Uh Bob and Weave. Beyond this point is confidential. Entries forbidden. Hey, there we go. Nato. <laughs> yeah, cause you wanna stick your dick in someone that knows how to handle a gun. Smart move. I said consensually and legally. Also, I love the fact that it's like, like, Nato has a gun, by the way. That's Nato's weapon of choice. And it's like, we're here with a bunch of fucking teenagers that are all older than Nato, and they're like, we're gonna fucking fuck around with a murderer. Let's carry a bunch of bats and kunais and chairs and fucking claws and goddamn, gr like, f fucking soldier boots and fans. A fucking fan, Yukiko. And Nato's like, hey guys. Why don't you just shoot the motherfucker? <laughs> like, come on. Why don't you just... Why don't you shoot them? With a gun. Come on. How many more floors until now to, like, maybe two? One? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ha ha ha. Come on, leave me alone, man. I'm just opening doors now because I'm panicking. Not thinking about it. Oh no. I got scared. Alright, sorry, what happened? And Teddy has Amarati. To take care of static conditions? Yeah, that's true. You'll Teddy's good for Bufudon. Anything to help the homie. <laughs> Gotta remember that high school students have access to powerful beings of magic, so it's kind of balance things out. I mean... So does the murderer! <laughs> like... Again! Would you rather have the magic thing and a sword, or the fucking a magic thing and a gun? Why am I garden? I'm sorry, I meant to escape. I wasn't paying attention. Oh, I did choose escape. Okay, cool. Just hang on. I'll find you an opening. Kanji, your agility has been lowered. Taking forever for that fucking opening, god damn it. Also, their personas work like stands, right? If you break the persona, they get hurt from it too. So like here comes fucking Izanagi running towards you. Just shoot that motherfucker. Just shoot him with a gun. <laughs> like, even Igus has guns on her arms because she's a robot. But still, you keep Igus around because she got gun. Remember when you got arrested because Yosuke is an idiot? Eh, I bet you wouldn't get arrested if Yosuke had a fucking gun. <laughs> What's that, officer? No, it's fake! Look! Huh. I mean, like, even Persona 5. You know what Ryuji does? He's like, my guy, listen, it's a fake, but it's a gun. And then, <laughs> and then Morgana goes, that's a fake? I'm gonna show you a fake, all right. He said, that's a fake, this is a fake. <laughs> There's a chest over there. I don't need to open it. Let's see. He would get arrested, he get fucking shot. Hey, at least he went out like the hero he wanted to be. <laughs> Anything for the story, man. Some Something's behind the door. Open the door and enter? Yes. No, 
Kato! Ah, it's about time you arrived. Dealing with this child has been quite a pain. No, oh, thank you for the follow. No, no, don't go. It's useless speaking with you. I need to go back now. Why? Why are you leaving me here? Why am I always left alone? Oh, Naoto, why you gotta leave Shadow Naoto behind? That's bad. It's so lonely. I don't want to be alone. Naoto-kun. You wear the same face as me. It's as if you're implying we're one and the same. But the difference between me and you is... <laughs> the hero who pissed in another world. He didn't piss. He tried to go, but he couldn't. He was too nervous. Why delude yourself? Oh shit, I didn't mean to skip that. childish gestures are no mere affectation. They're the truth. The fools all say it, don't they? You're only a child. Keep out of our business, kid, and so forth. No matter how many cases you spend hours cogitating over, no matter how many crimes you solve, you're a child in their eyes. It's your brain they're interested in, the gray matter locked up in that skull. As long as they need it, you're an ace detective. But once you're done, it's back to the playpen with you. You haven't the means to deal with society's two-faced nature. You're just a lonely child. Naoto. I want to be a grown-up. I want to be a big boy right now. Then they'll see who I am. Oh, poor little baby Naoto. I... I want a reason for me to stay. That's enough. I can find my own reason for living. <laughs> I'm telling you that's impossible. You are but a child. How can you change that essential truth? Stop it! At your core, you admire the sort of strong and cool men who populate detective fiction. But in trying to emulate them, you must know that in truth, you're nothing of the sort. You're a child. There's no avoiding first principles. Admit that you're a child, and admit that there's nothing you can do about it! Now then, our analysis is complete. Let us begin the body alteration procedure! You have no objections, do you, Naoto Shiragane? Stop it! Naoto. Such a cool, manly name. But a name doesn't change the truth. It doesn't let you cross the barrier between the sexes. How could you become an ideal man when you were never male to begin with? Wait, what? Did he... Did I hear that right? He's not a guy? I won't throw a tantrum. That accomplishes nothing. Oh, hallelujah, glorious day. So that means I'm not gay. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Kanji's like, oh my god. Oh, what a relief. I've heard those words from the adults. Throwing a tantrum won't solve anything now, Tokun, and other such bilge. They made you cry, didn't they? Yet here you are, mimicking those same men. What exactly are you trying to justify? What? It's all right. You needn't suffer anymore. That's why you're undergoing this body alteration procedure to begin with. You throw a tantrum, but it fails to change the situation a single bit. I can quite understand the feeling. After all, I am you. That's not true! Don't say it! It's okay. Let the kids spill the whole thing. If not, Naoto's just gonna keep hurting. We'll just do our job and kick the Shadow's ass, yeah? <laughs> As if you know anything about me. You'll kick my ass, huh? <laughs> Go ahead and try, you lizard brained imbecile. I was like the fucking delivery of that line. Like, you'll kick my ass, huh? <laughs> Save the discussion for later. Here it comes. All right. 
So Shadow Nato. Shadow Nato got some fuckery going on, okay? I am a shadow, the true self. Shadow Nato can use all types of the fucking element, all colors of the rainbow. Yes. Nato can also do some silence bullshit on you. What? Are you sick of yourselves too? Very well. Then let's begin the special operation. And I think Nato can change Bring Shadow Nato there. can change I'll her this. her resistances? Operation? I hate ouchies. In the original Persona, you would just silence Naoto and this fucking fight would become a joke, but now you can't do that no more. Have you made up your mind? Then let us commence. Alright. Uh, so I'm just gonna start off with guarding, because I want to know what the fuck you're gonna start using right off the bat. Those are my auto buffs. Um, well, I have no weakness. With my Persona of choice right now. Because I have resistance to fire. So I'm going to do that. What are you using Dikaja for? Alright, whatever. You want me to do some bullshit? Okay. Let's see. Where's, uh... Oh, I don't have Garudine for you yet? Alright. No problem. 90. There we go. Teddy, what do you got for me? Great blade. Ooh, nice job, Yosuke. Let's see. Alright, just wanted to make sure you still got the fence going. Fleet Foot Yosuke. That's why we love him. That's why we love Yosuke, and that's why we love, uh, Koromaru. I'm telling you, when I play Persona- when I play Persona 3, Koromaru is never leaving my party. Not once. Woo! Hey, you thought, Naoto? gonna re up. No, no, that will never do. Patience must lie still for me to drill proper holes into them. All right. Now here's the test. Oh. Someone heal him. All right. Don't remember that being on the menu. Shit. I'm actually gonna have you guard because I think. Your health is really low. Yeah, I can see that. Are you using electricity? Is that what we're doing? No, you're not using electricity. What are you using? Teddy, are you okay? Someone heal him. All right, that's not good. Um eh Guys, Teddy's health is pretty low. Let's see, here's poison, all ailments. There you go. Thank you. No problem, Ted. Here goes. That's what I like to see, Kanji. Oh 
shit. Ooh. That's fine. That's why we got this. Alright. Wait, where the hell is my revival beep? There it is. That's why we got this. That's fine. Mistakes were made. Rize, you don't tell me shit, right? Oh, you do. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm gonna heal up Teddy. Thank you. Do I have Dikaja? I think I used to have it. I'm not that worried about it, though. Nato doesn't really worry me too much. Um... Yeah, I'll just do more of that. I was thinking if I wanted to use a defense buff, but I guess not. Why must you struggle so much? Alright. Rakunda? See? See? I got the Kaja. I know I still got it. God damn it! Teddy dodged, but Yosuke didn't. Okay. All right. your health is really low. That's fine. Don't worry. For one. You're gonna pay, damn it! Yosuke Senpai, your health is really low. Um. I just wanted to see what healing items I had left. Alright. Last time she used. <laughs> uh, what the fuck? Is that a typo? <laughs> that is a typo. But you meant Maziodine, yeah? Yeah, no, I know. That's why I was surprised. Because cause fucking. Because, um, Yosuke has Evade on also with, like, an Elect Vow, I think. Vault Vow or something. Vault Suppressor. Something like that. And that's why I'm surprised that he didn't dodge, but Teddy did. Come on, Yo dodge Yosuke. You got, like... Oh, what the fuck. Alright. <laughs> I'm not gonna worry about keeping you guys alive for too long. I'm just worried about doing damage, honestly. I'm pissed now. And as long as... As long as you're not like... You know... As long as you're not completely fucking it up for me... I don't care too much. You lie down and die! You children can't do anything at all! Come on, Yosuke! Man, oh, man. oh no, you debuffed Teddy. My infinity went back up. So, this is where you would get all your buffs off, I guess? Because Anato starts using element zero. Think 
Here you go. Good job, Kanji. Just keep going in for the hits. That's what you're here to do, Kanji. Those multi-hits. Beautiful. In the original Persona, in Persona 4 Vanilla, didn't Naoto take like two turns? Nice job, Yosuke. I think Naoto took like two turns in the original. Come on, let's get, get the full hit. Full hit, Kanji. Yeah, that's what I like to see. And there's Element Zero. Come on, Kanji, you can do this. Finish it. Oof. Teddy, you want to get in a little pity hit? Oh my god, you just really hate these two. See you later, Nato. <laughs> Teddy's just on the floor. He's like, I can't get up. All right, senpai. I climbed the stairway to maturity. So Nato Kun was a girl. <sighs> Are you awake? Where am I? I remember you all arriving, and... That's right. You saw everything. <laughs> I lost both my parents in an accident. I was still young, so my grandfather took me in. I was inept at making friends, so I spent my time reading detective novels in my grandfather's study. When I grow up, I'm gonna be an awesome, hard-boiled detective. My parents were proud of their job. I had no qualms about following in their footsteps. An inherited occupation can feel stifling to many, but I welcomed it. I yearned for the day I could be a detective myself. Perhaps I inherited that desire from them as well. I was always alone. Seeing that, my grandfather must have believed it was his duty to help me realize my dream. I secretly aided my grandfather with his clients. And before I knew it, people started calling me Junior Detective. At first I was delighted, but not everything went so smoothly. What was that you said about you're only a child? I mean, you're all children, really. Not everyone welcomes my collaboration when it comes to solving cases. My status as a child was sufficient to offend many of those whom I worked with. Were that the only issue, then it would have resolved itself with time. But though I will one day change from a child to an adult, I will never change from a woman to a man. Oh, Japan. Oh, Japan. Welcome to the year 2022. Do you not like being a girl? Is that why you always dress like a boy? My sex doesn't fit my ideal image of a detective. Besides, the police department is a male-oriented society. If they had the slightest concrete reason to look down on me, no one would need me anymore. You don't know that. Hey. You must know already that what you yearn for isn't to become an adult or become a boy. <sighs> You're absolutely right. I'm sorry. I kept ignoring you, pretending you didn't exist. But you are me. And I am you. 
You've always been inside me. What I should yearn for, no. What I must strive for isn't to become a man. It's to accept myself for who I really am. The strength of heart required to face oneself has been made manifest. Nato has faced her other self. She has obtained the facade used to overcome life's hardships, the persona, Sukuna Higonda. In any event, you're a devious bunch. I can't believe you kept something like this hidden for so long. <laughs> no wonder the perpetrator has eluded the police. But it's apparent now, this case is far from over. That's right. And you proved it now, Tal. Anyways, we can talk more later. We need to get you out of here. Hey! Hey! Nato is breathing heavily. Sheesh. She really put her life on the line for this. But without her efforts, we'd never have realized that the culprit is still at large. I mean, you would have once her body appeared all dead and mangled. I never doubted that you'd all come for me. Aw, oh, you do like us. Although the reality turned out to be far beyond what I'd imagined. <laughs> what a dumbass. You're no genius at all. We were tearing our hair out over you. Especially Kanji, that's why he has a widow peak at the age of 15. So you did worry about her, Kanji. Oh. Shut up. M mind your own damn business. I'll take her home. I don't think she can go back by herself. It's all right. I can... No way, Missy! Don't think that doing everything on your own is the adult thing to do. Come on, let's go. Grab on. You were able to rescue Nato safely all in one day. And it seems the case is not over yet. Hey! Welcome back. Uh, sorry, we got off early today. Come on, take a seat. Oh, for once, though, Jim is not the drunk one. They found Naoto kun. Oh, uh, do you know who Naoto kun is? He just up and vanished without a word. But it looks like he's back now. Way to put a scare into everyone. Heesh. Damn, dog. I'm relieved. Hmm. You don't seem surprised. Well, I mean, I only knew the guy for a couple of days. I mean, am I supposed to go, <gasps> No to, oh my god! You didn't already know he was found, did you? Ah, uh, you really ought to do something about that habit of yours, Dojima-san. They go to the same school. Rumors spread fast out here, you know? But man, why'd Naoto-kun disappear? <laughs> Sheesh. <laughs> I guess he can be a little difficult. Maybe he got sulky after being given the boot and ran away from home. But I tell you, I was shocked to hear that he up and vanished like that. If there'd been a fourth kidnapping and murder, we'd be back to square one again. Oh shit, I didn't mean to press the button. You know what sucks? We still don't have proof that the Kubo kid murdered anyone besides Mr. Moraoka. How are we gonna make a case like this? I wonder if Dojima-san's instinct is right. Maybe there really is another perp out there. The real one. Adachi, how many times I gotta say it? Quit running your mouth like that! Well, sorry. Alright, see here. Don't worry about the case. Just go study like a normal student. If you don't... I'll beat your ass. <laughs> <sighs> Starts unfastening the belt. <sighs> I'm going to bed. Wait, who's taking Adachi home? Dude's drunk. It's the middle Sorry, of the night. Sorry, I killed the mood there. But yeah, I can totally understand why Dojima-san's worried. Just leave the case to us police. You know the problems it could cause if something happened, right? 
Like, if it happened you were mixed up in it, we'd be real worried. I would never be mixed up in anything like Are that. more scary things gonna happen? Of course not, Nanako. No way, Nanako-chan. Everything's alright now. We caught the bad man, so no more scary things will happen, right? Everything's just fine. Okay. Anyways, your dad's just a worry ward. Leave it to me. You might not know to look at me, but I got the most brains in the whole police department. Oh, was that too hard to understand? Did you get it? Well, now that Dojima-san's gone, I should get going too. Good night. And he fucking crashes through the table. <laughs> Just face plants. Good night. Ba bam. I doubt you went back home. What does got brains mean? It means you're smart. Huh. So things will be all right. Nothing bad will ever happen, Nanako. The night passes with the awkward mood hanging in the air. Would you like to save your game? Yes, please. Alright. <laughs> Whew! Didn't think I would do that tonight. You have the day off from school today. Wait for not to recover. What should you do? Realize that you haven't bought anything. Oh my gosh, stop telling me how to spend my money. How much money do I have? Damn. I just want to see what's on there. Oh! Repraisal chain. And a Soma! Oh, only one though. Neither. I'm straight edge. Alright. <laughs> we'll love it if that was the case. Then Anko just said he broke he broke a fucking table. <laughs> That'd be so funny. It's like when Rize is doing the King's game, I kinda like imagine her just like falling on top of the table, like banging her head on it. She's like, good night guys. Bam! Right? Do what a routine does when they have free time. <laughs> In the countryside? No, man. In this room? Hmm. Would he even be comfortable? Honestly, I look at this sofa and I'm like, that's not comfortable. That is not a comfortable sofa at all. It doesn't look comfortable to me. Anyways. Mm. Gotta stretch. Alright, so been going for, oh my god, almost five hours, holy shit. And I definitely streamed over my time limit by like an, by like an hour and a half, Jesus fuck. So, made some pretty good progress this stream, right? Gonna end it off here. <laughs> they were drinking non-alcoholic drinks, how they got drunk was a mystery. I don't know. I don't know. Kind of like how people think they're high after vaping, I guess. I don't fucking know. <laughs> pure, pure stupidity. But that's going to be it for tonight's stream, right? We got a lot done. Next time we come back to the stream, there's going to be more Persona. I think I'm going to focus on Persona for now because we're, we're kind of somewhat in the home stretch. So... Might as well just focus on it, get it done, get it out the way, start uploading it on YouTube and stuff like that, right? Um, so that's gonna be that's gonna be a uh, on the schedule tonight. I'll just change the schedule on the sh on the fucking um Twitch page or whatever. So tonight, around like, well, I'm on the fucking East Coast of the USA, so for me it would be uh like around twelve or two o'clock, like. 12 or 2 a.m. EST, right? So put that in your little computer and configure whatever the fuck you gotta do for that. <laughs> but that's next time. We're gonna do Persona later on tonight. More of this. Try and go for a little bit longer. And then 
as for the YouTube, right, I recorded some more episodes for Pokemon Red and Blue, so that's going to be going up today, right? I'm also, you know, I'm also going to see if I can record some Nightmare Before Christmas shit today. Get that up there. And then... I think that's pretty much it for me. That's the plan right now. I don't think there's anything else in between that I'm doing. Right? Uh, yep. That's pretty much it. So, you know, here on Twitch, if you want to follow me, feel free to do that. Right? I, I greatly appreciate it. If you want to sub, eh, you f feel free to, I guess. But, you know, not until I get like a like a regular schedule going on Twitch, I wouldn't really recommend it, honestly, right? Unless you just want to. So, yeah, there's that. On YouTube, you can watch some more playthroughs I did and stuff like that. If you like that, you can sub or whatever, leave a like on the videos, whatever the hell, you know, it helps out. And yep, it's a link to my Twitter, right there. For when I, uh, most of the time I put up like a notice when I'm going live on Twitter like I try to do it ahead of time by at least like 10 or 5 minutes and then uh, you know I just post some other dumb shit and that's pretty much it I'm not I'm not any I'm not I'm not anyone special I don't do anything crazy right so that's gonna be it for today once again I wanna say thank you guys for stopping by and watching thanks for Watching me fucking stall out a fucking, uh, a goddamn mid-boss, right? <laughs> Just sat there, kept guarding. Took way longer than it needs to be. So, I'm gonna get out of here. And then I'm gonna reload this and probably grind Yukiko and Chie up. And then, uh, grab me a peach seed and then beat Naoto again and get back to this spot so I can continue with more shit later. And yep, that's it for me. So, once again, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Stay happy, stay healthy, and take care.